Jack welcome to the club. Can you just sum up how you're feeling at the moment? No, yeah, it's great to be here. Obviously, um, I spoke to Graham and stuff about joining the club and everything about it seems really exciting and the club seems to be going in the right direction so I'm looking to be a part uh, excited to be a part of it. What were the main things that, that attracted you to the club? Um, there's a couple of big pulling factors to be honest. Obviously the, the fact that they've gone full time is a big one because um, I feel like the exposure to being on just being on the grass every day um, makes a big difference. Uh, where the club wants to be and sees itself in the next couple of years is also something that I really want to be a part of. Um, so yeah, it seems uh, really exciting at the minute. And the fans might be aware of you already from your, your past at Cardiff City. You know you had a loan spot at Hereford as well. Can you talk through your past experience in the game? Yeah, um, so I've, I was at Cardiff since I was bloody 13, 14 years of age. So I've spent a long period of time there, 21 now. Um, I had a couple of loan spells as well out like that. Uh, Welsh Premier League side, uh, the New Saints, and then Hereford as well in the Conference North. So I've had a little taste of uh, first team experience, but yeah, I'm just looking forward to getting in there, settling down, and really hopefully kicking on. Cardiff's obviously a massive club. I know you got a taste of, sort of on the bench with the first team a few times. Mm. You got training with the first team squad quite a lot. What was that experience like for you at your hometown club like that? Yeah, it was brilliant just to learn from them type of um, players and professionals, obviously really high level in the game so yeah I learned, I learned a lot from training and just being in and around them and yeah it was really helpful. How important is it for you now to, to kick on in your career and really get lots of senior minutes under your belt would you say? Yeah it's massive now. Um, I'm at the age where I think I, I really need to be playing first team football regularly week in week out um, and that's the only way I'm going to kick on and yeah I've got aspirations to play as high as I can hopefully like with, with South Shields as well we can go on and Hopefully play uh, yeah, a couple of divisions higher, maybe. And those who haven't seen you play before, how would you describe your, your style? Um, I think Graham obviously identified me as somebody who suits his style of play quite well. So um, I think the fans can probably get a gist of maybe how I play from that. Um, I like to see myself as a ball-playing defender. Um, obviously knowing that first and foremost the defensive side comes first. Uh, head in the ball. So um, yeah, I think I'm... I've got a bit of everything. You mentioned ball playing ability. That's so important in, in, in this day and age in football, isn't it? To be able yeah. to play out from the back. How, how much has that been drilled into you from an early age? Yeah, of course. Like Coming through the academy and stuff, I think that's where that really gets implemented. Sometimes a little bit too much, but um, I think that all the, the technical drills and stuff I've done over the years has really stood me in good stead to come into a, a um, environment like this and hopefully hit the ground running with the style of play. It's a long way from home for you as well, Cardiff yeah. to here, it's not an easy sort of journey to make. Does that sum up your, your commitment to this project as well, that you're willing to make that move? Yeah, um, obviously when Graham came came knocking and stuff, first of all, it was a bit of a um, surprise to be honest at first because of the distance and stuff, but then when I heard what he had to say and um, listened to everything that was going on here, then um, it made the decision a little bit easier and um, yeah, it was a a long old drive up yesterday but um, I'm happy to be here now and I'm really looking forward to uh, getting started. How did the move come about? Um, I was on, I was playing for Hartlepool actually, um, on trial there. Uh, played a game up at um, Blythe and I think the manager must have been there watching. Um, and then he, he got in contact straight after the game and like, I, I, it was a weird one because I didn't really expect that maybe this would be the move I was making but like I said, everything about it seems seems really good to be a part of and the stage I'm at now in my career is something that um, I think I'm a good fit for, for South Shields and South Shields are a really good fit for me as well. You mentioned that you came up yesterday, you obviously met your teammates for the first time over the last couple of days as well. What yeah. are your first impressions of, of the group that you walked in? Yeah, they seem a really good bunch of lads to be honest. They've helped me um, settle in really well. Obviously I'm staying in the house with a couple of the boys as well. I met them last night so coming in this morning was a little bit easier as well. So um, yeah, it's been... Uh, it's been nice and easy settling in. So obviously we're, we're at a certain level at the moment and we're wanting to get promotion as quickly as possible. So I guess the, the pressure is going to be on from minute one in the season. Is that something that you're really looking forward to, to sort of relishing? Yeah, definitely. I think um, that's been made clear to me straight from the off is that the only um, thing that's going to be acceptable this season is promotion. And I think that's um, the type of pressure we just got to take on our shoulders and hopefully we can um, execute everything the manager asks us to do and hopefully we can um, yeah, achieve promotion. 
over the last year or so you'll have experienced it just like everyone else playing without crowds mm. what's that been like for you as a player and, and how much are you looking forward to playing back in front of big sort of set of fans again? yeah it's um it, it has been tough and like if playing in front of crowds obviously gives you that extra bit of motivation and that extra drive so hopefully now we can have a full season playing in front of crowds and i've heard that the south shields fans are um they they follow well so Hopefully, I can experience that to the, the highest degree this season. No, see, you're still a very young player, but you've got quite a bit of experience at junior levels. I think you've been captain at national level. You've captained Cardiff at certain levels as well, haven't mm -hmm. you? How much are you going to try and bring that experience and that leadership maybe to the group as well? Yeah, I've um, captained Cardiff like throughout the age group, so I hope that um, the leadership qualities I um, may have gained through that I can bring bring in here and obviously the position I play as well. I feel like that's a that's a vital attribute to have so um, yeah hopefully I can bring that in and really stamp my authority on the team.